So here we have matrix A, and we want to add it together with matrix B. And notice how matrix A is a 2 by 2 matrix, and matrix B is a 2 by 2 matrix. So both matrices have the same dimensions, so we can definitely add them together. And the only thing that we need to do when adding matrices A and B together is we need to add the corresponding numbers. So what does that mean? We'll start with matrix A, and we'll start with the number in row 1 in column 1. That would be the number 7. And we need to add that with the number in row 1 in column 1 in the matrix B. And since both numbers are in row 1 and column 1, after we add them together, they will also be in row 1 and column 1. So now let's do the same thing with the numbers that are in row 1 and column 2. That would be the number negative 1 in matrix A, and that would be the number 5 in matrix B. And since they are both in row 1 and column 2, when we add them together, they are also going to be in row 1 and column 2. Uh, so now I'm going to do the same thing with the numbers in row 2 in column 1. In matrix A, that would be the number 5. And in matrix B, that would be the number 4. I'm going to add 5 and 4 together. And since they are both in the position row 2 in column 1, after we add them together, they are also in the position row 2, column 1. And finally, we'll do the same thing for the numbers in row 2 and column 2. We have a negative 4 and a 3, so I'm going to add these two numbers and also keep it in the position row 2 and column 2. So I think many of you get the idea and see how easy it is by now. Uh, the only thing that we need to do is just add the numbers together. In our row 1, column 1 position, we have the numbers 7 plus 2 which is just 9. In our row 2, column 1 position, we have 5 plus 4, which is also 9. In our row 1, column 2 position, we have negative 1 plus 5, which is 4. And in our row 2 and column 2 position, we have negative 4 plus 3, which is negative 1. So this is our resulting matrix when we add A plus B.